wave. <laughs> What's Any wells out today? Say hi to the camera. Hi, camera. Put your flippers on out here and back in, or You could always go out into the water and float and put on your fin. Uh, huh? No? Oh, this could be good.
should put them up there and back down. <laughs> Don't worry, the sand will go out of them as soon as you get into the water. Okay. Little step. Ah! You want to try backing in at this point? <laughs> One of these. Now, do we have anyone in the audience this evening that has tried opening one of these? You can take all the pictures you want because I own a stock in Kodak. Okay, here's the easy way. Kids, don't try this. It's going to be dangerous, all right? And I say special because we find these stones in the streams of the islands and they're very porous so they won't crack or explode when we heat these stones to very high temperatures. Now, after heating these rocks for several hours till they're red hot, they're then scattered in the middle, placing banana stalks and leaves around the hot rocks, placing the pig on top of there, 
place you more banana leaves on top of the pig and then cover it all up. Now cover it up with all this sand here and left to cook for about seven to eight hours, all depending upon the size. We took the sand off just a little while ago to make this process here just a little faster. At this time, I'd like to introduce two gentlemen. They've been working very hard from about seven o'clock this morning. Please welcome them with a round of applause in front of Seal and Talai. Give them a hand, gang. Yay! Where are they? Okay, right now they're gonna take this uh, off and apart here. They're gonna take this top layer of canvas off and they'll be exposing the banana leaves which contain a lot of moisture. Okay, so they aid in the steaming and the flavoring of the pork. However, no other flavoring is used in this method of cooking here at all. And you can bet that this oven is still very hot. You can still see some steam coming up. Now here in the islands of Hawaii we call the pig kalua pua. Kalua means to roast. And Puwa'a is the big roasted, of course, Hawaiian style. Anybody saw that series on television before, Green Acres? Yeah. We captured Arnold this morning, you know? <laughs> but to Mr. Ziffel now, right? Okay, this is just portion of your main course for dinner. Right now, we'd like to teach you another Hawaiian word, which we call Huki, H-U-K-I. Everybody here say Huki. Huki. Huki means to pull. On the count of three, let's hear that word really loud. Here we go, gang. Ready? One, two, three. Huki. Huki. Yeah, this is Kalua Pua. Right now, the gentleman will take it back to the kitchen where they'll debone it and get it ready for the buffet line. Now, after seeing this method of cooking, how many folks here are going to eat the pig with us tonight? Yay! Oh, not bad, not bad. All the rest of you, McDonald's opens till 10, okay? How about giving Seal and July another round of applause for us? Blah, 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 blah. All right, at this time, ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to invite you all back to your seats as we were going to get you ready for a fantastic meal. Hello! And of course, the Kalua Pua'a. Tonight we also have a bar that's going to be open to the show is this evening. <laughs>
Jersey and the Vermont Zone, Tennessee.